A student pilot tried to enter the cockpit on an Alaska Airlines flight three separate times before being restrained by passengers, and his supposed reason for this is strange to say the least. On Wednesday, court documents were released describing an alarming event that happened on board an Alaska Airlines 737 just earlier this month. The incident happened on March 3rd on board a 737-900 that had departed San Diego and was heading to the Washington, D.C. area. The documents show that a student pilot got up from his seat on three separate occasions, made his way to the cockpit door, and attempted to open it. For whatever reason, Reason, maybe someone in the comments can let me know the passenger wasn't subdued until the third attempt when the flight attendants asked off-duty law enforcement officers to detain the man. Before I tell you his reasoning, I want to know what you guys think. Was he trying to hijack the plane or were his intentions different entirely? The plane landed safely, but the man may have ruined his life because the laws he violated could lead up to 20 years in prison, and if I had to guess, he probably has no chance of becoming a pilot now as well. After he was subdued, the crew asked him why he attempted to open the door, to which he replied he was testing them.